Luckily, let's bring in Jeff Ranieri now. Luckily, it's going to be dry for a couple of days so that work can get done. Yeah, we're dry all the way through Sunday's forecast. And then we are going to be getting into some rain chances as we head into next week. And before we get to all that, I did want to share in some new numbers we're getting in today as we continue to see the benefits from those three storm systems we had in seven days last week. So let me show you what we have coming in right now. And this is awesome news. In California, a 10.77% decrease in extreme and also uh, exceptional drought. Marin County, a 96.64% decrease in exceptional drought. Now, it hasn't wiped out the drought, but it's taken us out of that worst category for most of Marin County. North Bay Reservoir is also a 17.27% water increase. And we got two more storms on the way as we head into next week. So certainly the North Bay getting the most benefits, but they also uh, did have the most storm damage they're continuing to clean up from. So let's bring it into tomorrow's forecast. And you can see we got this area high pressure. Pressure. That's what's been responsible for all of this amazing weather. I'd like to take credit, but uh, I got to give all that credit right over here. That high pressure now it's continuing to move off towards the east as we head through tomorrow. But I still think we're going to get one more day of this dry weather, mild conditions and also sunshine, making a lot of you happy after all of those uh, waterlogged days we had. So as we started off for tomorrow morning, we're going to begin in the 50s with a little bit of cloud cover streaming across. So jacket weather again with us 54 in the East Bay, San Francisco 55 and the North Bay at 53. Now temperatures are going to begin to cool off a few degrees tomorrow, but don't worry down here in the South Bay. Still got you in the 70s here. Let's get us at 74 Morgan Hill 76. So let's bring it over to the East Bay and you can see Vallejo at 72 Pleasanton 74 right near the Bay Hayward at 70. The peninsula dropping it back down to 72 in Palo Alto San Mateo 68 San Francisco. We had a few 70s recently, but now we're back into the 60s through tomorrow and for the North Bay. We have those 70s returning from you Kaya to Novato and then some 60s getting in there for Mill Valley. Now I think we're good for this again as we move through tomorrow's forecast, but by this weekend into next week, we're going to see some changes. So I wanted to show you what we're looking at here by this weekend. System to the north brings us some cooler conditions and some clouds and then by next Monday, that'll be our next chance of rain. So let me show you what we're seeing on those rain totals. Still about a quarter to a half inch on average. Better better that half inch total right up there towards the North Bay on the seven day forecast. San Francisco Francisco stays dry right through Halloween with 63 degrees and those rain chances not only for next Monday, but a second system next Wednesday and Thursday. That looks like it could have some stronger totals of a quarter to one inch and we'll see those 60s also returning for those inland valleys. So Friday TGIF it's almost here and it's going to be amazing and then we're, we're back to those cool wet conditions. Yeah, right after Halloween. Thank you so much. Halloween's it. been saved.